This right here is the all new Mahindra car. After all the suspense, all the teethers, all the spy images, it is finally here. The wraps have come up on Independence Day and just look at it. Doesn't it look fantastic? It's such a desirable looking SUV. Classic Jeep Qs, but updated and modernized. Now, obviously, we have to talk about the elephant in the room and the SUV, the 4x4, that this Thar looks very similar to. But you got to admit that Mahindra's heritage also harks back and traces its lineage back to the World War II Willys Jeep. So, in that sense, this Thar stays true to Mahindra's brand and to its heritage. It's got chunky fenders, the characteristic Mahindra grill, the Jeep knows it's overall a very stylish, very attractive looking car. Now over on the sides, it's got this classic silhouette, which is unmistakable. This is an unmistakable Jeep slash Thar silhouette. It's only a two door for now. There are no plans for the five door. And what you will notice here is the hard top. This is the factory fitted hard top. And that's just one of the ways in which Mahindra's engineers and stylists have tried to make the Thar more livable. Look at it from the back. Again, very cool. It's got excellent proportions, excellent stance. It runs on Seat Zar all-terrain tires. These are 18-inch tires, so they are big wheels. And this is an all-new platform. It's a ladder frame chassis, but it's a third-generation all-new chassis, and it runs on coil springs. No more leaf springs on the Thar. So that makes the ride better sorted, more livable. If you notice something else on the rear, it says automatic. That's right. The Thar now gets an automatic gearbox. And it also gets a new turbo petrol engine. Things that I never thought I'd say in relation to the Thar. But yep, it's got a 150 bhp turbo petrol engine made it to a six speed automatic gearbox. We'll go to the interiors and here the differences between the old Thar and the new Thar are night and day. This is a proper modern dashboard on par with anything else, any other SUV. If you check out the gear lever, that's the six speed automatic gearbox and next to that is the lever for the four low. So all variants of the Thar. Everything gets four low as standard. I've just cranked up the Thar and you can barely hear the engine. So this is the new infotainment system. It's got an adventure mode where you have off-road display. So this is the on-road display. You have an off-road display and you also have a custom display so you can customize what you want so say you don't want pitch you want only speed you can customize it and that's your display this is the waterproof display in fact the entire cabin is washable so even if you get filthy dirty the cabin you can just take a hose and pressure wash it important to note it's got ESP it's got hill hold it's got dual airbags so this meets modern safety standards and these buttons out here, that's for the information on the between the dials. So we run through the pages. So all the different information on the multi-information display. We'll show you something cool, but before that, we'll show you the rear seat. Now, for the first time, the Thar gets forward-facing rear seats getting in there is a bit of a challenge but once you're there 
two people can fit comfortably and it's forward facing it's not those jump seats so it's no longer prison being in the back of the thar now this is the hard top you can these are the speakers for the stereo this roof panels they come off and you can have it as a convertible the engine extremely refined extremely silent you can barely hear it running just listen to the way the doors shut no longer does it have that metallic twang it sounds like a sophisticated car obviously thar badging 4x4 on the rear so that's the new mahindra thar we'll do a quick walk around on it the prices will be announced on october the 2nd that's when it goes on sale but now finally the wraps are off and everything that we expected in terms of the styling is all there it looks brilliant it looks desirable but in terms of the driving that really is surprising it is so much more civilized so much more livable you can actually use the thar as your daily driver it doesn't have to be just as a weekend toy or the second or third car in the family it can be the only car and you can use it and you will enjoy it mahindra have delivered a cool lifestyle product that is so desirable and to end this is something that you must check out everybody talks vocal for local and all that but check out the wind plate made in india with pride that's so cool it makes you proud that the thar has been designed engineered sourced everything in india and a perfect vehicle for india for indian enthusiasts this is your quick look at the all new mahindra thar we'll have a full video on our youtube channel very soon and you're watching evo india subscribe to the evo india channel and hit the bell icon to keep pace with the thrill of driving